कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्णा डियर डिवोटीज थैंक यू फॉर ज्वाइनिंग अस लेट्स स्टार्ट विद जय राधा माधव प्रेस हरे कृष्णा जय राधा Krishna 
डियर डिवोटीज आप सबका स्वागत है आप सबका अभिनंदन है हरे कृष्णा देवी हरे कृष्णा डियर व्यूअर्स वेलकम एवरीवन आपका खूब खूब स्वागत है अभिनंदन है आज की ये जो कृष्ण कथा है श्रीमद् भागवतम क्लास है प्रभु जी चैप्टर लेवल पर ब्यूटीफुल लेसन लाए हैं कि ये जो हमारा लाइफ का फाइनल एग्जाम जब आता है अंत समय आता है हमारी कॉन्शियसनेस कैसी होनी चाहिए सो दैट वी कैन अचीव परम गति सो लेखा राज जी वेलकम कौशिक मैती जी हरे कृष्णा संतोष जी बैसाखी जी हरे कृष्णा गणेश राजेंद्र सन श्रीकांतो विभोर जयंतो ब्रह्म मोहन ब्रज मोहन बिट्टू ओम प्रकाश धर्मेंद्र हरे कृष्णा डियर व्यूअर्स गणेश राजेंद्र सिंह हरिबोल करा कृष्ण विद्यानिधि सेमोल नारायण हरे कृष्णा प्रभु जी देर आर लॉर्ड ऑफ व्यूअर्स सभी का बहुत बहुत स्वागत है हरे कृष्णा डियर डिवोटिस प्लीज ज्वाइन अस फॉर मंगलाचरण प्रेयर्स ओम नमो भगवते वासुदेवाय ओम नमो भगवते वासुदेवाय ओम नमो भगवते वासुदेवाय नारायणम नमस्कृत नरम चैवानरोत्तम सरस्वती व्यास तथो जय मुदीरिए शवता स्वकथा कृष्ण पुण्य श्रवण कीर्तन हृदय तस्ह्य भद्राणी विधुनोती सुहसता नष्ट प्रायु अभद्रेशु नि भागवत सेवया भगवतीम श्लोके भक्तिर्भवि नष्ट की Hare Krishna dear devotees so today we are covering shrimad bhagavatam canto 4 chapter 23 hare krishna and the title of the chapter is maharaj prithus going back home back to godhead hare krishna devi can we share the link yes prabhu ji i am sharing hare krishna so again please join us in the recitation of these verses and then when we start this particular lesson first i would like to you know share the blessings from this maharaj prithu's past times that are revealed by sage maitreya right who is one of the descendant of aditi so they are adityas right so here he is revealing it to who to mahatma vidur and this narration of you know maharaj prithu ka jo ye varnan hai is jo maitreya muni bata rahe hain mahatma vidur ko is later on recited by सुखदेव गोस्वामी उसका वर्णन बाद में सुखदेव गोस्वामी करते हैं 
परीक्षित महाराज के सामने और जब परीक्षित महाराज सुनते हैं तो ही इज सींग कॉमन फैक्टर्स लाइक हाउ ही इज गेटिंग द मसी ऑफ द लॉर्डशिप एंड सिमिलरली हाउ महाराज पृथ्वी को भी भगवान की कृपा मिली और किस तरह से वो वापस अपने गोलोक धाम वापस चले गए हरे कृष्ण सो अगेन ही वेंट बैक टू वैकुंठ सो किस तरह से महाराज पृथ्वी हु वॉज अ शक्ता वे शक्ता वापस चले गए और इसका वर्णन इस सभा में सुत गोस्वामी ने सुनी फ्रॉम सुखदेव गोस्वामी और महाराज परीक्षित थे जहाँ पे तो बाद में जब वो नैम शरेना गए तो वहाँ पे ग्रेट सिजस की असेंबली में उन्होंने इसका वर्णन दिया जब उनको श्रीमद भागवता में रिसाइड करने को बोला गया उनसे जब रिक्वेस्ट की गई तो प्लीज ज्वाइन अस इन द रिसिटेशन ऑफ द फर्स्ट थ्री वर्सेज सो दिस इज वेरी ऑस्पिशियस वेन वी हम लोग जब मंत्रों का ये उच्चारण करते हैं जो ये श्लोकस हैं तो इससे बहुत ऑस्पिशियस मीन्स अगेन बहुत ही शुभ वातावरण हो जाता है ऑस्पिशियसनेस बहुत अच्छी तरह से फैलती है एंड वी बिकम क्लेंस ऑफ ऑल काइंड ऑफ अनर्थस अन मीन्स नॉट अर्थ मीन्स जिस मीनिंग जिसका कोई मीनिंग नहीं है ऐसी क्वालिटीज रखे क्या फायदा राइट सो दैट्स लाइक इट्स लाइक अ कूड़ा राइट इट्स लाइक गार्बेज सो वाई शुड वी कैरी सो वी एक्चुअली गेट डिलीवर्ड ऑफ दिस अनर्थस वेन वी डू द श्रवणम एवरीथिंग स्टार्ट विथ श्रवणम हियरिंग then chanting right so again please join us in the recitation of the first three verses shrimad bhagavatam canto 4 chapter 23 verse 1 through 3 maitreya vacha drishvatmanam pravayasam ekada vaini atmavan atmanavadhi tashesha swanusarga prajapati hi जगतस्तुशापी वृत्ति दो धर्म वृत्त सता निष्पादितश्वरादेशो यदर्थम यह जगीवान आत्मेज आत्मजेश्व आत्मजाम्य वीरहादरुदतिवा प्रजासु विन विमन Translation by His Divine Grace, Swami At the last stage of his life, when Maharaj Prithu saw himself getting old, that great soul who was king of the world divided whatever opulence he had accumulated amongst all kinds of living entities, moving and non-moving. He arranged pensions for everyone according to religious principles, and after executing the orders of the supreme personality of Godhead in complete coordination with him, he dedicated his sons unto the earth, which was considered to be his daughter. Then Maharaj Prithu left the presence of his citizens, who were almost lamenting and crying from feeling separation from the king, and went to the forest alone with his wife to perform austerities. Hare Krishna. So again, Maharaj Pritu was a shaktavi shaktar. So and, and so he came from Vaikuntha to perform this pastime and return back home, back to Godhead. So this was to set an example and to attract innocent living entities, you know, who are suffering in this world. <coughs> Hare Krishna. So please join us for Guru Prati. Namo Om Vishnu Padaya Krishna Prishthaya Bhutale Shimate Bhakti Vedanta Swami Niti Namine Namaste Saraswate Deve Gauravani Pracharine Nirvishesha Shunyavadi Paschatya Deshitarine Om Ajnana Timirandasya Gyananjana Shalakaya Chakshurun Militam Yena Tasmay Shri Gurve Namaha मुखम करोति वाचाल पंगु लंघयते गिरी यदम वंदे श्री गुरु दीनतारण श्रीकृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु निनंद श्री अद्वैत गदाधर शिवा सादि गौर भक्त वृंद हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे सो संत कबीर एक बहुत ही इंपॉर्टेंट मैसेज दे रहे हैं राम नाम की लूट है लूट सके तो लूट 
अंत काल पछताएगा जब प्राण जाएंगे छूट सो अगेन देर इज अ ग्रेट मार्केट प्लेस वेयर वी कैन गेट एज मच एज वी कैन लॉर्ड राम्स नेम सो अगेन राम एंड थ्री टाइम्स राम एज लॉर्ड शिवर इज इज सेम एज वन टाइम सिंग लॉर्ड कृष्णा सो अगेन and that three times saying lord ram's name is equivalent or one time saying lord krishna's name is equivalent to the sahasra vishnu naam so again thousand names of lord vishnu so these are coming from the scriptures these are coming from the great personalities and vaishnava naam yatha shambhu lord shiva jo hai he is the greatest vaishnava jo you know supreme hamare material universe mein jo top most devotee hai wo kaun hai lord shiva right shambhu and so we have to take to his instructions and shrimad bhagavad gita mein lord krishna ne chapter 18 mein attaining the supreme bataya hai so again chapter, chapter 8 so again and uske na jo fifth and sixth verse hai they are considered very auspicious antakal you know me kya karna chahiye antakale cha mame va smaranukta kale varam yah prayati samad bhavam yati nastatra samshaya भगवान कृष्ण कह रहे हैं कि अंत समय में जो भी मेरा ध्यान करते हुए अपने प्राणों को त्यागेगा राइट तो उसका क्या होगा स्मरण मुक्त व कलेवरम यानी एक्सक्लूसिवली भगवान का ध्यान रखते हुए यू नो कॉन्स्टेंटली रिमेम्बरिंग द लॉर्ड एक्सक्लूसिवली एट द लास्ट मोमेंट ऑफ लाइफ देन वन अटेन्स द सुप्रीम अबोर्ड राइट वन गोज बैक टू वै कुंठा वै कुंठा वै मीन समथिंग दस डिवाइड ऑफ ऑफ वॉट कुंठा एंगजाइटी यू नो वरीज so one is completely you know devoid of all kind of aspirations lamentations and so forth and goes back home back to god head aur yahan pe maharaj prithu ka example diya hua hai jo ki jinko instructions kahan se mile the unko instructions mile the sanat kumar se you know one of the four kumaras and all four kumaras ke unko darshan bhi hue the hue the aur unhone and again so he is showing that you have to come in a disciplic succession even though lord vishnu had blessed him lord vishnu said that once one day in the garden you will meet sanat kumar and so it is very important for us to understand from the instruction ke hame diksha guru ke ta sharan leni hi padti hai jaise ki sanat kumar in this particular case gave him instructions so again he was instructing his spiritual master and instructing his spiritual master is considered non different from you know uh, initiating spiritual master so again they are on the similar platform so bhagwan jo hai hamare hriday mein chaitya guru ki tarah hai aur you know he when sees the devotee ready to surrender jo humko dekhte hain jeevera swarup hai krishna nitdas ke hum apni jo swarup hai hamara jo constitutional position hai usme jo hum establish karne ke liye apne aap ko taiyar ho rahe hain to us samay bhagwan hamare samne hame guru bhejte hain और गुरु की कृपा से हम कृष्ण को पा सकते हैं और ये विधि होती है दिस इज द प्रॉपर प्रोसेस अब भगवान कृष्ण खुद कहते हैं भगवत गीता में तद विधि प्रणिपाते न परि प्रश्न न से वया उपदेश यंती तज ज्ञानम ज्ञान नस्तत्व दर्शन तद विधि प्रणिपाते न सो अगेन एज पर द प्रोसेस यू नो फॉलोइंग इन द डिसिप्लिक सक्सेशन सो दैट इज द प्रोसेस परी प्रश्न से वे सो अगेन वी हैव टू टेक शेल्टर ऑफ अ बोनाफाइड स्पिरिचुअल मास्टर अ बोनाफाइड स्पिरिचुअल मास्टर हु इज अपियरिंग इन परंपरा हु इज यू नो हेल्पिंग अस डिलीवर अंडरस्टैंड हु लॉर्ड कृष्णा इज बट नॉट फ्रॉम द परस्पेक्टिव ऑफ स्कॉलरशिप बट विद द परस्पेक्टिव ऑफ फीलिंग थिंकिंग फीलिंग विलिंग सो दैट वी आर कॉन्स्टेंटली थिंकिंग ऑफ द सुप्रीम पर्सनैलिटी ऑफ गॉड हेड वी फील द लव द डिवोशन द ग्रैटिट्यूड for all the blessings that we are getting and then we are willing to engage all our senses mind body and senses all our activities are dovetail in the service of lord shri krishna which simply starts with the chanting of the holy name hare krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 rama hare rama ram rama hare 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 krishna so again yahan pe maharaj prithu jo hain unhone kya realize kiya ke he was getting old तो वो जो थे वो हुए थे त्रेता युग में सो वो आए थे त्रेता युग में उस समय पीपल हैड द लाइफ ऑफ टेन थाउजेंड्स ऑफ ईयर्स बिकॉज सत्युग में पीपल कुड लिव अप टू हंड्रेड थाउजेंड्स ऑफ ईयर्स देन त्रेता युग टेन थाउजेंड ईयर्स देन द्वापर युग थाउजेंड ईयर्स एंड देन कलयुग मैक्सिमम ऑफ अ हंड्रेड ईयर्स यू नो सो दैट इज 
the body that we have in the given environment, in the given situation, and this is only for the earthly planets. Because you don't see the Chatur Yugas uh, influencing the higher planets. So, uh, you know, and he was the emperor of the world. Yet, when he saw that he is getting old, what are the signs you are getting old? When your eyes are going weak, right? When our eyes are weak, our eyes are weak, our eyes are weak, our hands are weak. When our condition is weak, we know that we are old, we are old, we are old. So, again, jara, you know, when we are old, जन्म मृत्यु जरा व्याधि दुख दोषानु दर्शनम सो दीज आर द फोर मिजरीज इन दिस मटेरियल वर्ल्ड इन फोर फॉर्म्स इट कम्स जन्म व्हिच इज टेकिंग बर्थ सो अगर आप ध्यान दें किसी डॉक्टर से भी पूछो तो बताएगा कि बर्थ के समय द बेबी गोस टू लॉट ऑफ पेन लॉट ऑफ एंजाइटी लॉट ऑफ ट्रिबुलेशन और मृत्यु अगेन मृत्यु के समय आने अंत काल में ऑफ कोर्स पीपल आर ऑलरेडी इन एंजाइटी थिंकिंग कि अरे अंत काल आने वाला है एंड जरा इज ओल्ड एज राइट एंड व्याधि इज डिजीज कंडीशन पैंडेमिक के समय एवरी वन इज केयर नॉट टू गेट सिक एट ऑल सो दैट इज द मेन यू नो लेसन दैट वी टेंट टू लर्न के ये जो है फोर काइंड ऑफ मिजरीज दैट वी आर फेसिंग जो हमारे इस भौतिक जगत में बिकॉज वी हैव एक्सेप्टेड दिस मटेरियल बॉडी दे कम विद इट राइट एंड ऑन टॉप ऑफ दैट द कली एज हैज इट्स इफेक्ट दैट्स वाई हम लोगों का जो है कलीज के इफेक्ट के कारण हमारा जो जीवन है बहुत छोटा है राइट सो इट इज़ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टू अंडरस्टैंड दैट यू नो अल्पायु भी होती है डिस्टर्ब भी रहते हैं बहुत सारी कंडीशन होती है लेजी होते हैं यू नो नॉट सो लकी एंड कॉन्स्टेंटली यू नो इन एंगजाइटी रहता है लेमेंटेशन रहता है अबाउट द पास्ट एंड एक्सप्रेशन होता है अबाउट द फ्यूचर प्राय अल्पायुष्य सभ्य कला वस्मिन युगे जना मंद सुमंद मत्यो मंद भाग है उपलब्धता भगवान सुखदेव गोस्वामी ट्वेल्थ कैंटो में थर्ड चैप्टर में बता रहे हैं कि ये इफेक्ट्स क्या हैं इस कलीज के प्रायण अल्पायु सो हमारी कलीज के समय में अल्पायु होती है सभ्य कला वस्मिन युगे जना कला कलह जो होता है क्वारलसन People are just ready to pick up a po- topic and start quarrelling and start arguing. You know, even when they come to the temple, it's amazing. Lord Krishna and you know the acharyas also reveal that, you know, that is dham, that is transcendental to the material world. But they try to find reasons to drive their inauspiciousness even in the temple environment, because it's transcendental. But people may be in various modes of material nature, so they show that mode. and they pollute the environment of the temple premises so it should be very we should be very careful in the temple premises ki hame kis tarah se behave karna chahiye and kala avasmin yuge jana manda manda means lazy sumand matyo sumanda is you know matyo sumand yana very small what mati right intelligence mand bhag and they are unlucky bhagya bhi nahi hai right and upradhuta and they are constantly disturbed so these are the symptoms एंड देन सुखदेव गोस्वामी रिवील कर रहे हैं परीक्षण महाराज को क्या कि इसमें इस एज में भी एक बून है क्या बून है दैट दिस कलेर दोष निधे राजन अस्ति है एक महान गुण कीर्तना देव कृष्ण से मुक्त संगा परम व्रजे कलेर दोष निधे राजन सो दिस जो कली एज है इट इज अन ओशन ऑफ फॉल्स अस्ति है एक महान गुण बट इट हैज वन ग्रेट क्वालिटी कीर्तना देव कृष्ण से जस्ट बाय सिंगिंग द ग्लोरी जस्ट बाय ग्लोरीफाइंग लॉर्ड श्री कृष्णा यू नो बाय रिमेम्बरिंग एंड ग्लोरीफाइंग हिज नेम फॉर्म एक्टिविटीज पास टाइम्स बाय डूइंग कीर्तन बाय डूइंग भजन बाय डूइंग यू नो कृष्ण कथा मुक्त संग यू नो वी कैन बी डिल यू नो फ्री फ्रॉम द क्लचेस ऑफ दिस माया माया गुणास गुणास आर लाइक रोप्स सो वी आर बाउंड इन दिस मटेरियल वर्ल्ड विद दिस रोप्स बट दोज रोप्स आर इमीजिएटली वी आर रिलीज फ्रॉम दोज रोप्स फ्रॉम द बाइंडिंग ऑफ दोज रोप्स and param vrajit and we can attain the supreme abode back kuntha hari krishna so these boons are there so we should be very very careful and we should be considering these are good fortune that we can have the opportunity to engage our mind body and words speech in the chanting of the holy name hari krishna hari krishna 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 hari 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 rama hari rama 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 hari hari सो so, पृथु महाराज अपने अंत समय पे क्या कर रहे हैं 
he's a shaktavi shabda who came from the spiritual world should you know and shakta which means again he was a living entity like a jiva right uh, so again from as a jiva he was showing by his example how we should live but what kind of shakti did he have we have covered this in the he had the ruling potency of the lord ke kaise rule karna he was a perfect ruler and he was the emperor of the world and when he realized ke unka sharir ab thoda you know vriddh ho raha hai किस जिस तरह से तो उन्होंने अपने घर को त्याग दिया अपने राज्य को त्याग दिया और वन की तरफ चले गए और उनकी जो वाइफ है अर्ची वो उनके साथ गई सो वैन पृथु महाराज लेफ्ट फॉर द फॉरेस्ट थिंकिंग रियलाइजिंग दैट ही इज गेटिंग ओल्ड देर इज ऑल्सो सम सेट ऑफ रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी दैट नीड्स टू बी डन विच इज जब आप जाते हैं तो यू हैव टू मेक श्योर दैट द एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन द रूलिंग एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन हैज टू बी प्रॉपरली अरेंज सो ही distributed the various parts of this world to moving and non moving living entities so now this is very important he had five sons and he dedicated his five sons to take care of this planet earth right bhumi devi is the presiding deity of earth and bhumi devi was like his daughter so again we heard as how he leveled the surface of the earth made it suitable for agriculture so this is a very important piece he is showing that a ruler has to do and go at great lengths to make sure that people are able to sustain themselves and be happy so that they engage not in the you know lower levels of this pyramid you know eat sleep may different but rather engage in devotional service keval annamay pranamay and you know manomay ki stage pe nahi but actually anandamay vigyanamay us stage pe aaye you know which is our true uh, positive place for us to spiritually advance so hum bhakti mein jab lage hote hain anand bhay abhyasat shastras reveal and acharyas reveal ke we are always seeking happiness right there is you know most all the people they are engage in this material world in various kind of activities to seek happiness some are engage in karma karm uh, you know various kind of activities fruitive activities so that they can satisfy their senses but then that's like putting ghee in fire and when you put ghee in fire does the fire burn out no unless you put so much ghee that the oxygen is disconnected which happens in the case of avanti brahman it is not possible to uh, you know die kill the fire completely so actually it the senses become more strong and they seek more and more so people who are engaged in fruitive activities they are like chasing mirages in the desert so an animal chasing mirages in the desert as soon as it's thinking oh there is water chases but there is no water and then at a distance sees oh there is water so this is what is happening they are having one goal after another goal after another goal and before they know the life has passed and they are at the door step of death and at that time they are chastised heavily un log ko dand milta hai for having spoiled this rare human form of life and they are thrown into animal kingdom or you know hellish conditions so again there is a whole series of uh, description given in shastra is how someone comes in before getting to the animal kingdom kisi pashu pakshi ya kisi uh, you know lower jeev ke form se pehle usko kaisi hellish conditions jo hum fifth canto mein cover kar chuke hain pehle kis tarah se usko suffer karna padta hai so here uh, it is very important for us to understand ki jo uh, लिविंग एंटिटीज हैं वो डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ एक्टिविटीज करते हैं कुछ होते हैं कर्म योगीज ना वो आर कर्म योगीज दैट दे एंगेज इन यू नो सर्विस ऑफ द सुप्रीम पर्सनैलिटी ऑफ गॉड हेड एंगेज इन प्रोपिगेशन एंड वॉट एवर दे गेट दे एंगेज बैक इन लॉर्ड सर्विस सो दे डोंट कीप एनी थिंग फॉर दम सेल्स बट एंगेज एवरी थिंग इन लॉर्ड सर्विस स्प्रेडिंग कृष्णा कॉन्शियसनेस थ्रो आउट द वर्ल्ड दैन कम्स ज्ञानीज ज्ञानीज आर वंस हु आर सेंग ओ दिस मटीरियल वर्ल्ड इज very dangerous if you engage in any activity there is a reaction to it not realizing that actually that karma good activities which causes pious reaction then the impious activities or sinful activities against the injunctions of the shastra which causes negative reactions causes distress and then there is a karma devotional service by they don't realize that by engaging in devotional service you are actually not getting any reaction so that is why means again we should understand that even get a best of all the gyanis is bahunam janmanam ante gyanvam mam prabudyate 
वासुदेव सर्वमिति स महात्मा सुदुर्लभा सो लॉर्ड कृष्ण हिमसेल्फ सेज के आफ्टर मेनी मेनी बर्थ अ ज्ञान योगी रियलाइजिंग दैट लॉर्ड वासुदेव कृष्ण इज द सुप्रीम पर्सनैलिटी ऑफ गॉड एंड सो अगेन ही सरेंडर्स अन टू द लोटस फीट ऑफ लॉर्ड कृष्ण एंड बिकम्स अ भक्ता एंड सिमिलरली अष्टांग योगी and here the example in the shastra is giving of the chatur kumars themselves they were you know like siddhas they were the you know best of the mystics and still it was the smell of tulsi you know that entered their nostrils and transformed when they saw padmana vishnu when they touched padmana vishnu they were completely transformed and they understood that the topmost yogi is a bhakti bhakti yogi भक्ति का जो योगी होते हैं यानो जो भक्त होते हैं दे आर द टॉप मोस्ट योगी योगी नाम अपनी सर्वेशाम मद गते नातरात्म नाम श्रद्धावान भजते यो माम स मे युक्त तमो मता सो ऑफ ऑल द योगी इज लॉर्ड कृष्ण रिवीज इज योगी हु इज भजते यो माम स मे युक्त तमो मता प्रॉपर प्रोसेस प्रॉपर इंजेंशन फॉलोइंग द फुस्टेप्स ऑफ आचार्य इज वन हु एंगेजेस इन द सर्विस ऑफ द लॉर्ड भज गोविंदम भज गोविंदम गोविंदम भज मूल मते इवन शंकराचार्य श्रीपद शंकराचार्य ही रिवीज दैट द टॉप मोस्ट सर्विस इज टू एंगेज इन यू नो भजन क्रिया ऑफ लॉर्ड गोविंदा एंड भजन इज नॉट जस्ट वर्शिप वर्शिप इज यू नो वन ऑफ द नाइन नौ अष्टा विधि में से बट भज गोविंदम इंक्लूड्स ऑल डिवोशन सर्विस एक्चुअली इट मैच द ट्रू सिनोनेम ऑफ भज और भजन क्रिया इज डिवोशनल सर्विस सो वी शुड ऑल एंगेज इन डिवोशनल सर्विस सो महाराज पृथु ने उसी को फॉलो करते हुए यू नो ही गेव अप हिज किंगडम एंड ही वेंट बैक ही वेंट टू द तपोवन तपोवन इज वे यू नो वन कैन डू तपस सो अगेन द रूलर्स दे वुड मेक श्योर दैट दे आर सम फॉरेस्ट वे दिस फ्रोशियस एनिमल्स आर नॉट देयर सो दैट पीपल हु आर लुकिंग फॉर रिटायर्ड लाइफ एंड वन प्रस्थ वन वन प्रस्तम इज वन हु इज रेडी टू गो टू द फॉरेस्ट सो वॉट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ वन प्रस्थ इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इफ समन इज लिविंग इन अ होम बट इज हैज कम्प्लीटली मिनिमाइज द बॉडिली नीड्स एंड एंगेज कॉन्स्टेंटली इन डिवोशन सर्विस राइट भज गोविंदम भज गोविंदम देन वन हैज कम टू दैट पर्टिकुलर प्लेटफॉर्म एंड टू बी एबल टू एंगेज इन डिवोशन सर्विस इट इज very important to take to the chanting of the holy name hare krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 rama hare rama 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 hare hare mana tahe ti ti mantra jo man ko deliver karta hai you know to aap usko mantra kehte hain so this is the meaning of mantra so basically the focus is that we have to become mindful not mindless sometimes people in ignorance they say you know mind does not matter matter you know don't mind the matter but in reality mind matters because you know it is very clearly revealed that jo mind hota hai wo apna next destination define karta hai lord krishna 8th chapter mein 6th verse mein khud bata rahe hain and hum isko yami mantra kehte hain yam yam vapi smaran bhavam tajantant kalevram tam tam evati kontya sada tad bhav bhavita सो so, जो माइंड का स्टेज होता है एट द लास्ट मोमेंट ऑफ लाइफ तो वही आपका नेक्स्ट डेस्टिनेशन डिटरमिन करता है सो दिस होल प्रोसेस जो है ना वो है अपने आप को डिवोशनल सर्विस पे एंगेज करने के लिए टू डवटेल द माइंड इन कॉन्स्टेंटली रिमेम्बरिंग द लोटस फीट ऑफ लॉर्ड कृष्णा एंड इसीलिए आचार्य गोविंद दास जी ही इज रिवीलिंग दैट वी हैव टू एंगेज आर माइंड भज हु रे मन श्री नंद नंदन अभय चरण रविंद रे भज हु रे मन श्री नंद नंदन अभय चरण रविंद रे दुर्लभ मानव जन्म सत्संगे दुर्लभ मानव जन्म सत्संगे तरह रे भव सिंधु रे तरह रे भव सिंधु रे शीत आतप वातवरी शण दिन यामिनी जागिरे 
शीत आतप वातावरीषण ये दिन यामिनी जागिरे विफल से विनु कृपण दुर्जना विफल से विनु कृपण दुर्जना चपल सुख लाभ लागी रे चपल सुख लाभ लागी रे हे धन यौवन पुत्र परिजन इत किया छे पर तीति रे हे धन यौवन पुत्र परिजन इत किया छे पर तीति रे कमल दल जला जीवन टल मला कमल दल जला जीवन टल मला भजहु हरि पद नीति रे भजहु हरि पद नीति रे श्रवण कीर्तन स्मरण वंदन पाद सेवन दास्य रे श्रवण कीर्तन स्मरण वंदन पाद सेवन दास्य रे पूजन सखी जन आत्मनिवेदन पूजन सखी जन आत्मनिवेदन गोविंद दास अभिलाष रे गोविंद दास अभिलाष रे भजहु रे मन शिनंद नंदन भय चरण रविंद रे so its translation is also very powerful we samajhna chahiye meaning right so oh mind so we are actually trying to dovetail our mind in the service of lord krishna just worship the lotus feet of the son of nanda nanda nandana which makes one fearless having obtained this rare human birth cross over this ocean of worldly existence existence hari krishna <laughs> so it is very important that we, this material world is uh filled with uh, all kind of uh, tribulations through association of the saintly persons and then in the second stanza he is revealing that both in the day and night i remain sleepless suffering the pains of the heat and cold wind and the rain for a fraction of flickering happiness i have usually served wicked and miserly men what assurance is there now third one is telling us that uh, you know with association with the body how we could be uh, in a trap so what assurance is there of real happiness is there in all of one's wealth youthfulness sons and family members this life is loitering like a drop of water on a lotus petal therefore you should serve and worship the divine feet of lord hari and finally then you know never vidhi so jo hum log ka devotional service hai that we should engage in you know shravan kirtan vishnu smaranam achanam vandanam dasyam sakyam atmanivedanam so we should always be engage in shravan hearing kirtan you know is uh, uh, chanting smaranam vishnu smaranam so again uh, remembering the lordship pad sevanam by serving the lotus feet achanam achana is the deity worship so again Prithu Maharaj attained perfection through Achana Vidhi. He performed 99 Ashwamedha Yajyas. The 100th one he was performing, Indra became insecure. And so he interrupted. Lord Brahma said, so be it, don't worry about create, uh, doing another one because the purpose of religious principles is, you know, again, Yajyas is to spread religious principles, establish religious principles. And Indra is causing a lot of irreligious principles, just the opposite of Dharma Phala. So again, so he is 99. And then Lord Vishnu came to bless Prithu Maharaj and brought Indra who asked for forgiveness from Prithu Maharaj. So again, his 99 Yajyas were greater than the 100 Yajyas, you know, Indra had performed. Why? Because he surrendered to the will of the lord so that is the glory sometimes people just just want to perform something not realizing that it may be against the injunctions of the shastras it's just for name fame and glories people do this or maybe just sometimes feeling good right and uh, it's you know people sometimes become sentimental right so mental has various state some you know so we have to not be driven by the mind the mental states like 
being judgmental or sentimental. Rather, we should be dovetailing our mind in serving the Lord in devotional service. And so, Archanam Vandanam, so again by singing prayers to the Lordship. And Dasyam, by serving the lotus feet of Lord as a servant and being friendly to the Lord Sakyam and Atman Nivedanam, surrendering everything in the service of the Lordship. So that should be the purpose. And that's the purpose of Vanaprastha. So Prithu Maharaj, he, you know, apna gharba chhodke, properly authorities ko hand over karke, the, the administrative, you know, arrangements, then he left his home. So now Parikshit Maharaj, jab ye sunna hai, to unko bhi yaad a hai. He was also the emperor of the world. And when he was cursed by Shringi, the son of Shamikarishi, at that time he left his home. But before leaving his home, he made sure that Janmejaya is the new emperor of the world and that all his other sons are supporting him and everything has been very nicely arranged. And then he left his kingdom to fast for seven days at the bank of Ganges. And the Ganges is referred to as Jeeva Goswami revealed that actually it is Yamuna Tatpe. Because in Delhi, it is Yamuna Tatpe, Hastinapur. So, in this way, वो सेवेन डेज के लिए फास्ट कर रहे हैं और जब सुनते हैं कि अरे पृथ्वी महाराज तपोवन के लिए गए तो उसमें क्या किया ये जान के उनको और खुशी होती है क्यों क्योंकि उनको ये रियलाइज होता है शिवदेव गोस्वामी उनको रिवील कर रहे हैं कि एक्चुअली पृथ्वी महाराज थे उन्होंने अपनी बॉडीली नीड्स कम कर दी एंड अगर आप बॉडीली नीड्स कम करने की बात सोचें तो ईट स्लीप मेड डिफेंड राइट सो ये चीज़ें कम होनी चाहिए Parikshit Maharaj ne to eating zero kar di thi because seven days he is fasting. He is not taking any food, he is not taking any water. So eating ki facility is khatam. Sleep for seven days he is staying awake listening to Srimad Bhagavatam. So he is, you know, sleeping in the cities are minimized. And then he is controlling his senses so there is no reason for recreation or mating. And then defense, he has surrendered completely at the lotus feet of Lord Shikrishna. He has taken shelter of Shukdev Goswami as his spiritual master. So of course, this is completely, he has you know, nullified all his easily made defense factors and he is completely, you know, dependent on the mercy of Shukdev Goswami and Krishna and the sages who are gathered there. So similarly, when he is hearing, he is feeling very nice that Prithu Maharaj, he left his home and his wife, Archi, she accompanied him. And even though she was like the empress of the world, right? She was his, you know, Prithu Maharaj's wife. Still, you know, she had very soft feet. Archi had very soft feet, yet she walked onto the, you know, jungle path in the jungle, which is full of thorns and hard stones. And she was engaged in serving her husband when he was reducing the necessities of life. And Prithu Maharaj ke baare mein bataya gaya hai ki kis tarah se wo austerities perform kar rahe the. That, you know, by reducing the, so in the summer time, there are five kinds of fires he was exposing himself to completely take shelter at the lotus feet of Lord Shri Krishna. Now, the Acharya has done a very important thing. It appears like he is following a strong yoga. But in reality, you know, having received the instruction from Sanat Kumar, he is actually engaged in devotional service as per the Shastras. And Shastras are defining, you know, the injunctions are based on time, place and circumstances. Samay, Kaal and Patra ke hisaap se hota hai. Jo wo injunctions ko follow kar rahe hai, Shastras ko jo hai unko follow kar rahe hai. और जो प्रोसेस है उस समय त्रेता युग जो कि 10,000 इयर्स ऑफ एज होती है वो उनको फॉलो करते हुए ही इस एक्सपोजिंग हिमसर टू द हॉट सन हॉट ग्राउंड यू नो एंड यू नो इन फ्रंट ऑफ फायर ही इस एंगेज इन डिवोशनल सर्विस सो कांस्टेंटली 24 बाय 7 ही इस एंगेज इन डिवोशनल सर्विस ऑफ द सुप्रीम uh, severe uh, austerities but uh, the body he is so strong and sometimes even today we see some yogis they are meditating on Himalayas and uh, they are able to withstand the cold because the strength is inside the pranavayu that is where the strength lies and with the city life you know hum log weak ho jate hain, so we cannot take such austerities and it is not even recommended the simple piece that's recommended is the chanting of the holy name. 
हरे कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे और रूप गोस्वामी इसको रिवील कर रहे हैं अतः श्री कृष्ण नाम आदि न भवे ग्रह इंद्रिय सेवोन मुखे ही जीवा दो स्वयं एव स्मृत्य था अतः श्री कृष्ण नाम आदि लॉर्ड कृष्णा नेम फॉर्म एक्टिविटीज पास टाइम्स न भवे ग्रह इंद्रिया आज सेंसेस आर सो ग्रॉस सो डल दैट दे के नॉट परसीव द प्रेजेंस ऑफ द लॉर्ड ही इज प्रेजेंट इन एवरी वन हार्ट एज सुपर सोल एज परमात्मा बट वी के नॉट सी हिम बिकॉज आर सेंसेज आर वेरी डल राइट सेवोन मुखे ही जो लेकिन हम कैसे देख सकते हैं जब हम अपनी जीवा जो हमारे टंग है जब हम उसको भगवान की सेवा में लिखे हैं सेवा में लिखे ही जीवा था सोए में वस्प्रत अब हम जीवा को किस तरह से एंगेज कर सकते हैं दैट टू वेज वी कैन एंगेज फर्स्ट वन इज चैंटिंग ऑफ दोनी में हरे कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे एंड कृष्ण कथा को सुनाते हुए सुनते हुए हम अपनी जीवा को यू नो ग्लोरिफिकेशन कीर्तन ऑसम इज कीर्ति साया है कीर्तन वर्ड विच मीन्स टू ग्लोरीफाई राइट सो ग्लोरिफिकेशन ऑफ द लॉर्डशिप जो हम अपनी टंग को एंगेज करते हैं और सेकेंड वे है जब हम कृष्ण प्रसाद ही खाते हैं क्योंकि कृष्ण प्रसाद का मतलब होता है मर्सी सो वी गेट द मर्सी ऑफ द लॉर्ड और वो टंग को प्योरीफाई करता है सोए में वस प्रोत एंड लॉर्ड रिवील्स हिमसेल्फ टू अस सो लॉर्ड हू के नॉट यू नो इज वेरी डिफिकल्ट टू बी फॉर योगी टू सी सिंपली रिवील्स हिमसेल्फ टू हिज devotees where they should do labham a do labham atma bhakto it is very difficult to approach the lordship through the vedas but a do labham you know but very not so difficult atma bhakto by engaging in devotional service to to the devotee lord reveals himself and he is easily approached so prithu maharaj is austerities perform kar rahe hain and he is actually following the injunction of the shastras based on samay kal and path the time place and circumstances and he is constantly you know at that time at the last moment as it's approaching he is now merging the elements in the reverse cycle right earth is getting merged into water water is you know because water was the source for earth and water is getting merged into fire so and then because fire was the source of water, uh, water and then fire is getting merged into air so the reverse cycle is going on and then fire is getting merged into air air is getting merged into ether and finally you know he is merging into the supreme brahman and finally going back home so he attains the planet so it is not that he is merging into the supreme brahman jo bahut si baar log mistake kar lete hain ye sochte hue ki are prithu maharaj was following ashtang yoga system he was you know uh, uh, in in kumar sampraday mein hain and those were impersonalists yes they were gyan is in the beginning but they became bhaktas so sometimes people are still stuck in the you know previous history if we look at it if people cannot change that means it's very impossible for anyone who is uh, nitya siddha to become nitya baddha and nitya baddha to become nitya siddha so again people in this material world are all nitya baddhas but by going back home they, they transform this uh, role and they become you know eternally devoted to the supreme personality of godhead and they are living they are living in eternal bliss constant transcendental bliss because that is the uh, jo bhakti ka jo uh, blessings hain that are transcendental bliss sweet mellows and lord krishna is the reservoir of all transcendental mellows all transcendental bliss so it appears that he is going but it's very clearly identified that a uh, yogi can attain whatever planet that they design this material world and there's a beautiful picture depicting this in bhagavad gita as well let me try to see if i can bring it out so here here is a picture hari krishna where the yogi can meditate and so he rolls his uh, pranavayu you know to the stomach then to the heart to the throat then to the mind and through the skull you know his uh, the living entity the jiva his soul uh, you know the shakta vishakta prithu maharaj he through the skull by breaking the bone on the skull on the top of the skull he returns back home back to god to the planet that he had come from and so archi when she sees that there is no life symptom in her husband's body then she prepares a 
यू नो पायर यू नो चिता तैयार करती हैं उसके ऊपर अपने हस्बैंड को प्रॉपरली यू नो जैसा कि रिचुअल होता है आप जैसे कि विद प्रॉपर स्पिरिट राइट सो एज पर द इंजेंशन ऑफ द शास्त्रस अपने हस्बैंड की बॉडी को उसके ऊपर ले करती हैं एंड देन मेडिटेटिंग ऑन हिज यू नो फॉर्म एंड ऑन हिज मेमोरीज शी एंटर्स इन टू द फायर सो ये जो सती प्रथा है ये आचार्य रिविल करते हैं इट इज़ नॉट लाइक अ रिचुअल दैट वन हैज फोर्स टू द वाइफ वुड फाइंड सो डिफिकल्ट टू लिव इन दिस मटीरियल वर्ल्ड दैट शी वुड प्रिफर द फायर ऑफ दैट पायर यू नो जो चिता की अग्नि वो बियरेबल है कंपेयर टू द सेपरेशन फ्रॉम अर हजबेंड एंड बिकॉज शी वॉज मेडिटेटिंग ऑन अर हजबेंड शी अटेन्स द सेम डेस्टिनेशन एज अर हजबेंड सो अर्ची अलॉन्ग विद महाराज पृथ्व दे बोथ रिटर्न बैक होम बैक टू बैक कुंठा so that has been revealed now there are wonderful blessings in this chapter so let's go through some of these blessings so matra muni bata rahe hain ki greatest of all devotees maharaj prithu wo itne powerful the unka character itna liberal magnificent and magnanimous tha right aur unhone jitna unhone jitna suna tha uske hisab se unhone mahatma vidur ko ye samjhaya bhi hai to jo bhi person is jo great characteristic tha maharaj prithu ka विथ फेथ एंड डिटर्मिनेशन डिस्क्राइब करता है राइट right? जो भी रीड करता है जो भी सुनता है सो ऑल यू श्रोता गान यू आर ऑल हियरिंग राइट एंड हेल्प्स अदर्स टू हियर ऑफ दैम सो सम ऑफ यू आर शेयरिंग इट एज वेल सो यू आर हेल्पिंग अदर्स हियर इट यू नो इज शो टू अटेन द वेरी प्लानट विच महाराज पृथु अटेन सो इज शो टू रिटर्न बैक होम बैक टू गॉट इट सो दैट्स द फर्स्ट ब्लेसिंग दैट मीन्स वी विल नॉट बी इन कुंठा एनी मोर इन द वर्ड्स ये जो पर्सन है will also return home to the vacant planets back to godhead so we don't want to be in this material world but we want to be in the service of the lord shiva which is possible in the vacant planets fully and jo bhi sunta hai the characteristic of prithu maharaj or you know apne varn ke hisab se agar brahman hai to wo ban jata hai perfectly qualified kis pe brahmanical powers pe agar wo kshatriya hai to wo पूरे वर्ल्ड का किंग बन सकता है अगर वो वैश्य है अगर मर्केंटाइल पर्सन है मर्चेंट है कैपिटलिस्ट है देन ही कैन बिकम द मास्टर ऑफ अदर मर्चेंट्स और ट्रेडर्स एंड विल बी द ओनर ऑफ मेनी एनिमल्स और अगर वो शुद्र है देन ही कैन बिकम द टॉप मोस्ट डिवोटी और ये फर्क नहीं पड़ता है कि वो आदमी है या औरत सो अगेन द यू नो सेक्स बेस्ड डिस्टिंक्शन नहीं है वेदर द पर्सन इज अ मैन और अ वुमेन एनी वन जो ये बहुत ही रिस्पेक्ट से आदरपूर्ण इस नरेशन को सुनता है महाराज पृथु का ही विल बिकम अ पेरेंट ऑफ मैनी चिल्ड्रन एंड इफ विदाउट चिल्ड्रन सो अगर किसी का संतान नहीं है तो उसको महाराज पृथु की कथा सुननी चाहिए किस तरह से वो आए किस तरह से उन्होंने अपना रूलिंग किया किस तरह से वो वापस भगवत धाम को आ, की प्राप्ति हुई उनको एंड अगर वो पुअर है तो ही कैन बिकम द रिचेस्ट इफ विदाउट मनी सो अगेन अगर किसी के पास धन नहीं है तो धन ध्यान की उसे पूर्ति होती है भगवान मीन्स महाराज पृथु का जब वर्णन सुनता है जो कि शक्ता विश अवतार है और जो इस नरेशन को तीन टाइम सुनता है राइट विल बिकम वेरी रेपुटेबल इफ इज नॉट रिकगनाइज इन सोसाइटी सो अगर किसी को मान चाहिए लेकिन उस वक्त ज़्यादा मान नहीं होता है सोसाइटी में अगर वो इस नरेशन को सुनता है तो उसका बहुत मान होता है सोसाइटी में और वो बहुत बड़ा स्कॉलर बन सकता है जिसके पास नॉलेज नहीं है जो कि लिटरेट है सो इवन अ पर्सन हु इज़ नॉट लिटरेट कैन बिकम अ ग्रेट स्कॉलर एंड जो दूसरे शब्द में कहा गया है कि जो नरेशन है महाराज पृथु का वो इतना ऑस्पिशियस है कि वो सारे बैड लक को ड्राइव कर दूर भगा देता है राधर एंड ऑल गुड लक कम्स एंड एम्ब्रेस द डिवोटी हु इज फेथफुली विद डिटर्मिनेशन एंड विद डिवोशन हियरिंग दिस नरेशन और जो पृथ्वी महाराज का जो नरेशन है इसको सुनने से क्या होता है वन कैन बिकम ग्रेट राइट एंड ग्रेट ने ग्रेट इज वन वन हु इज ग्रेटफुल सगेन वन हु इज you know humble one who is tolerant so that is the quality definition that is the uh, you know cause and effect if you want to be great then you have to become grateful you have to have the right attitude of gratitude and you have to dovetail your mind in devotional service or aise mein uska duration of life increase hota hai so people who want to live long life you should hear about maharaj prithu his you know lifetime how how he ruled very nicely and how he attained 
his, the perfection at the end of his life. And one can attain promotion even to the heavenly planets and counteract the contamination of this age of Kali. So, we have heard the effect of this Kali age. Sunne the prayana al payush sabhya kala vasmi nuge jana mand sumand matyo mand bhag hai pradhuta. Shikde Goswami in the 12th canto mein ye characteristic batayein hain jo humne pehle discuss kiya bhi. So, these are the bad effects that go away. Rather, one gets promotion even to the heavenly planets. People go through big tribulations to engage in fruitive activities. And they try to acquire whatever they have to have better destination at the end of their life. And they do big, big yagyas. But it only takes an hour to hear about Maharaj Prithu and all his wonderful activities. Shravanam is very important. And he lagi na fit kari, rang bhi chokha hoi. So, yahan pe bina kisi effort ke one can even elevate oneself to the heavenly planets and counteract this contamination jo anathas hai is kali age ke, jo bhi bad effects hai, jo bhi negativity hai. One can invoke all auspiciousness. Or in addition, one can promote the causes of religion. So, again, dharma, earth, kama, moksha. Yeh jo achieve karna chate hai, wo bhi asani se kar sakte hai. So, from all directions, all auspicious will come. Sorry, achhi, achhi. Jo qualities hai, the person will be endowed with those. So, it is advisable for a materialistic person. What to talk about devotees? Even a materialistic person, jo ki in chijo ko parta hai, unke baare mein sunta hai, narration of the life and character of Maharaj Prithu can attain all auspiciousness, all great qualities, all wealth. So, again, is tarah ki blessings di hui hai. And Maitreyamani himself ye reveal kar rahe hai Mahatma Vidur ko. Aur agar koi raja hai, jo ki bohat jada vijayi hona chata hai, bohat strong ruling power, administrative power chata hai, usko to chant karna chahiye narration of Prithu Maharaj three times before going forth on his chariot. So, isko aaj ke samay pe bohat hi asani se acharyas ne adopted kiya hai, ki agar koi raja ya koi bhi administrator three times Maharaj Prithu ka narration sunta hai, before starting their daily work, right, before starting their day, the administration, right? So, sare jo bhi subordinate kings honge, they will, you know, render proper, you know, service, proper reciprocation by giving all kinds of taxes unto that person, all kind of respect to that person, all kind of reciprocation to his ruling administration. And, jaise ki, Maharaj Prithu ke andar, jo ki, you know, is Vishwa ke samrat the, unko jo different, different raja the, is Prithvi pe, वो सिंपली टैक्स देते थे अपॉन हिज ऑर्डर एंड अ प्योर डिवोटी जो कि भक्त है प्योर भक्त है हुज एग्जीक्यूटिंग द डिफरेंट प्रोसेस ऑफ डिवोशन सर्विस देन नाइन प्रोसेस ऑफ डिवोशन सर्विस वी डिस्कस एंड देन रूपक गोस्वामी फर्दर इलेबोरेट्स इनटू 64 प्रोसेसेस यू नो मे बी सिचुएटेड इन ट्रांसजेंडर पोजीशन बीइंग कंप्लीटली अब्सॉर्ब्ड इन कृष्णा कॉन्शियसनेस जो कि कांस्टेंटली भगवान की भक्ति में you know, Bhagavan ke bhavnamrit bhav mein unki stuti kar raha hai. As a pure devotee bhi, while discharging devotion service, must hear, read and induce others to read about the character of the life of Prithu Maharaj. Because, Bhagavan Krishna kya kehte hai? Yagya daan and tap, yeh joh pure soul se unko bhi purify kate hai. Toh yeh hum loo ko sterity perform kani hai. To hear Shavaram is a kind of austerity as well. Or is tara say, you know, one can even be purified. You know, who's pure can even become purer or purest in the process. Or sage Maitreya is tara batane ke Maharaj Vidur, or Mahatma Vidur, my dear Vidur, I have as far as possible, as far as possible, spoken the narration of Prithu Maharaj, which enriches, वंस डिवोशनल एटीट्यूड तो हम लोगों की भक्ति सुदृढ़ होती है हमारी भक्ति बढ़ती है और जो भी हम इसका बेनिफिट ले सकते हैं वो क्या है बेनिफिट इस टू गो बैक होम बैक टू गॉड है जस्ट लाइक महाराज प्रथु ही रिटर्न बैक होम बैक टू गॉड है राइट सो लाइफ फाइनल एग्जाम एंड हाउ टू कम ऑफ विथ फ्लाइंग कलर्स इज बिन रिवील इन दिस पर्टिकुलर चैप्टर द ब्लेसिंग्स हैव बिन रिवील और इसमें आखिरी में बहुत ही इंपॉर्टेंट ब्लेसिंग दी है Whoever with great reverence and adoration regularly reads, chants and describes the history of Maharaj Prithu's activity will certainly increase unflinching faith and attraction for the lotus feet of the Lord. The lost lotus feet are the boat by which one can cross the ocean of nascence. So, Maitreya Muni is telling us that whatever the love of the Lord, 
ध्यान से यू नो श्रद्धा पूर्वक अट्रैक्शन से अफेक्शन से यू नो एब्जॉर्बन से रेगुलरली रीड करता है महाराज पृथ्वी की हिस्ट्री उनके बारे में चैंट करता है डिस्क्राइब करता है उनके वंडरफुल एक्टिविटीज़ यू नो विल बिकम अट्रैक्टेड टू द लोटस फीट ऑफ लॉर्ड कृष्णा अब जब ये रिवील किया है तो बहुत सारे लोग बोलते हैं वाई डू यू वॉन्ट टू बी अट्रैक्टेड टू लोटस फीट ऑफ लॉर्ड कृष्णा राइट तो इसके बारे में शिवदेव गोस्वामी बहुत ही प्यारी वर्ष बताते हैं टेंथ कैंटो में समाश्रिता ये पद पल्लव प्लव महत पदम पुने यशो मुरारे भवाम बुधिर यत्स पदम परम पदम 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 यत विपदाम न तेषाम सो समाश्रिता समाश्रिता मीन्स वन हु इज हैविंग टेक इन शेल्टर ऑफ हु यू नो ये मीन्स दोज हु टेक शेल्टर ऑफ हु ऑफ पद पल्लव प्लव पद इज द लोटस फीट राइट द फीट ऑफ द लॉर्डशिप एंड विच आर लाइक द पल्लव प्लव पल्लव मीन्स are like flower buds so they are very soft lord's feet are very soft and they are the perfect boat plavam plavam means boat so they are the boat and what what do you need boat for to cross over this ocean of nescence mahat padam so of the total material creation or of the great souls so one who has taken shelter of the supreme personality of god here can easily cross padam the shelter mahat padam so one you know of the total material creation so or of the great souls so one who takes shelter of the great souls punya so, supremely auspicious yasho one who is famous right murare mur mura ari mura means the mura demon ari means the enemy of so who's the enemy of mura demon lash krishna murari is another name is murari murli dhar is one who holds murli but murari means enemy of mura demon and bhava of this material existence ambudhi or the ocean so this ocean of nescence is referred to as this material universe which is very difficult to cross right but it reduces to the size of a calf's hoof print what's a padam and so one can easily cross over this and attain what attain the param padam the supreme abode vaikuntha padam padam you know at every step yet you know in this material world where you know vipadam there is vipatti you know there is uh, misery at every step of this material world so one does not stay in this material world where there is danger at every step but rather attains the supreme abode so that is the reason we want to go back home we want to be in vaikuntha we want to be in anandmay transcendental bliss so we must take the to the lotus feet of lord shri krishna as revealed by shukdev goswami and so here in the last uh, verse purpose shila prabhupad is revealing this that, that the word bhava sindhu pot pade is significant in this verse it's very important hai bhava sindhu pot pade you know the lotus feet of lord krishna are known as mahat padam you know the supreme shelter and this is means that the total source of material existence rests on the lotus feet of the lordship you know it's all coming from the lordship so again bhagavad in bhagavad gita lord krishna in chatush loki the first verse in the 10th chapter it verse is aham sarvasya prabho the everything is emanating from lord krishna so this cosmic manifestation which is considered as the ocean of nescence right jo hum isko bolte hain na mrityu sansar sagarat <laughs> that is ocean of nescence is also resting on the lotus feet of the lord because he is the cause of all causes and as such this great ocean of nescence is minimized by a person who is a pure devotee who is engaged in devotional service 24 by 7 one who has taken shelter of the lotus feet of the lord need not cross over the ocean for he has already crossed it by the virtue of his position at the last lotus feet by hearing see shamanam is very important and chanting again you know chanting of the holy name glories of the lord of the lost devotee one can become firmly fixed in the service of the lotus feet of the lord this position can be also be achieved very easily by narrating the history of the life of prithu maharaj regularly every day the word vimukta sangha is also significant in this connection because we associate with three qualities of material nature what are the three qualities again the three modes of material nature sattva guna raja guna tamo guna and then there is the three kinds of miseries in this material world which is you know uh, bhautik 
आध्यात्मिक एंड आदि दैविक सो भौतिक इज मिस इज कमिंग फ्रॉम अदर लिविंग एंटिटीज आदि दैविक इज मिस इज कमिंग फ्रॉम द नेचुरल डिस्टर्बेंसेस बट आध्यात्मिक इज द वन द मिस इज क्रिएटेड बाई वन ओन माइंड एंड नाइन्टी नाइन पॉइंट नाइन परसेंट नाइन 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 परसेंट इट इज द आध्यात्मिक सो अगेन द मिसरी इज कमिंग फ्रॉम वन ओन माइंड इज वॉट इज प्रिवलेंट इन दिस पर्टिकुलर टाइम सो अगेन इन दिस कली एज सो वी शुड बी वेरी केयरफुल एंड एंगेज आर माइंड इन डिवोशनल सर्विस थ्रू आर सेंसेज थ्रू आर वर्ड्स थ्रू आर बॉडी सो माइंड बॉडी एंड वर्ड्स ऑल एक्टिविटीज कैन बी परफॉर्म इन दिस वेज एंड दिस एक्टिविटीज शुड बी डव टेल इन लॉर्ड कृष्ण फॉर द प्लेस ऑफ लॉर्ड कृष्ण सो बिकॉज वी एसोसिएट विद दीज थ्री क्वालिटीज ऑफ मटेरियल नेचर आप पोजिशन इन दिस मटेरियल वर्ल्ड इज फुल ऑफ डेंजर्स पदम पदम यथ वे पदम नाम एट एवरी स्टेप देर इज डेंजर इन दिस मटेरियल वर्ल्ड so we don't want to be in this world but when we engage in the devotion service of the lord by the process of shravanam and kirtanam we immediately become vimukta sangah or liberated and we attain param padam you know we attain the supreme abode vaikuntha so th- this is where this chapter ends and it's very important for us to understand that when we hear about the lordship when we hear about the pure devotees when we hear about his incarnation and shaktavesh you know is a like shaktavesh avatars are basically living entities who have been empowered by the supreme personality of godhead just like sometimes people say okay devashi narad he is a shaktavesh avatar a pure devotee of the lord he is a shaktavesh avatar of the devotion what kind of shakti the devotional service of the supreme personality of godhead so he is endowed with that potency so we should take shelter and again it is devish narad who incited uh vyasdev shri krishna uh, shila krishna dwapanya vyasdev to write shrimad bhagavatam and that's where we are getting through every single verse you know the glorification of devotional service so that we take to devotional service and make our life blissful devoid of all kind of miseries and experience transcendental bliss devoiding all kind of miseries means we are coming to level 0 but now we want to rise to level infinity from minus infinity to zero is devoid of all kind of miseries but we want to get to that infinity on the positive side anand bhay obvious that we all seeking happiness which simply comes by the engagement of devotional service hari krishna hari krishna 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 hari 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 rama hari rama 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 hari hari mantra <coughs> shrimad bhagavatam ki jai shila prabhupad ki jai shila bhagavat pad ki janand kauri vaishnav vind ki jai nitay go premanande hari hari bol hari krishna devi do we have any question so prabhu ji we can ask if we have few minutes yes. we can do some question answer yes Dear viewers, अगर आपके स्पिरिचुअल लाइफ से रिलेटेड कुछ एंक्वायरीज हैं प्रभु जी कैन आंसर योर क्वेश्चन नाउ सो प्लीज टाइप योर क्वेश्चन इन द कमेंट्स एरिया एंड वी कैन रीड दम अलाउड हरे कृष्णा सो प्रभु जी थैंक यू फॉर दिस ब्यूटिफुल श्रीमद भागवतम क्लास एंड लेट मी चेक इफ देर आर एनी क्वेश्चन देर इज वन क्वेश्चन प्रभु जी रिलेटेड टू चैंटिंग Karuna Sindhu Prabhu ji has a question Prabhu yes. ji how can we make our chanting more effective as sometimes it feels we are chanting from the empty heart So again when we are chanting we have to chant with deep devotional feelings <clears throat> Chanting should be exclusive time <clears throat> where we should hum log ko bilkul baaki sari kriyaen band karke apne mind ko fully चैंटिंग में लगाना है हमें माइंड फुल रहना है माइंड लेस नहीं रहना है माइंड लेस चैंटिंग इज नॉट इफेक्टिव बिकॉज दैट्स यू नो इन अटेंड चैंटिंग इज ऑल्सो एन ऑफेंस टू द होली नेम नाम अपराध है इन अटेंडिंग चैंटिंग सो अगेन वी हैव टू बी वेरी केयरफुल हमें अपना अपराध नहीं करने हैं यू नो नो ऑफेंसेज टू द चैंटिंग ऑफ द होली नेम नाम अपराध नहीं करना है हमारे को अविद्या में नहीं रहना है हमें फुल्ली कॉन्शियस रहना चाहिए हमें समझना चाहिए चैंटिंग का मीनिंग क्या है हरे कृष्ण महामंत्र का मीनिंग क्या है मन स्मरण करते हुए उस पर क्योंकि इट्स अ प्रेयर ओ मदर राधे ओ लॉ श्री कृष्ण प्लीज एंगेज मी इन योर ट्रांसडेंटल डिवोशन सर्विस प्लीज कीप मी एट यू लोटस फीट सो अगेन इसको मेडिटेट करते हुए हमारे को रिपेंट करते हुए अपनी लोली कंडीशन को एंड कॉन्स्टेंटली थिंकिंग सो अगेन एंड most important is attentive right that is mindfulness we have to be very mindful 
when we are chanting because it's a prayer it's not a ritual that you are just you know calling out these words because you are directly interacting with krishna you know lord krishna and his name are non different as revealed in the shastras and by the acharyas and this is to please shri shri radha madan mohan ji so again shri shri radha raman ji shri shri radha krishna so we are doing this for the pleasure of the lordship we want to engage in devotional service not for our pleasure but the for the pleasure of lord rishikesha who is the master of the senses rishikesha means is master of the senses so all our senses will be purified and will experience transcendental bliss when we satisfy the master of the senses by satisfying our senses we can never seek happiness that is just the wrong formula in this material world people are bewildered and they are engaging like you know asses like donkeys to satisfy their senses and that is where they are becoming more anxious more disturbed right pravarga we talked about pa pa ba ba ma pravargas as it appears in the you know um, hindi mein jo hamare hote hain swar and vyanjan pa is parishram people engage in all kind of parishram for fruitive activities and fir kya hota hai phena so again they start foaming so we see in the case of horse when the horse runs a long time foaming happens in its mouth so one it gets very tired very exhausted by this heavy parishram by heavy endeavor and per per bur bur is like bewilderment so one becomes bewildered in this material world that i am doing so much heavy work i am getting so exhausted but i am not seeing any results so is bewildered his memory is bewildered in this state and then becomes fearful bha bha is bhay bhay is like one becomes fearful in this material world or is fearful state may not understanding and bewildered and fearful state one passes his life and comes to the ma stage which is mrityu at the last stage so again many people they try to go in the direction of fruitive activities and by the time they reach some destination they see actually the success is on the other side you know on in engaging in devotional service because they have become more disturbed than before while a person who seeks to engage in devotional service seeks to the chanting and chanting you know sevon mukhe hi jivado just by engagement in chanting lord reveals himself to us and sometimes people even question how could you know name of the lord same as lord krishna right so again in the shastras it is clearly revealed you know chintamani krishna chaitanya ras vigraha purna shuddho nitya mukto abhinatvam nam namino nam chintamani krishna so lord krishna's name is like you know it is chintamani which is like desire fulfilling stone it's not parasmani parasmani is you touch parasmani to iron it turns into gold but chintamani is like which delivers all your desires all your thoughts that's chintamani राइट नाम चिंतामणि कृष्ण सो भगवान कृष्ण का जो नाम है वो चिंतामणि है डिलीवर्स ऑल आर स्पिरिचुअल डिजायर्स राइट ऑल फुलफिल्स ऑल आर स्पिरिचुअल थॉट्स चेतन्य रस विग्रह एंड इट्स एंड डोट विद ऑल काइंड ऑफ पोटेंसीज ऑफ लॉर्ड श्री कृष्ण सो इवन इफ यू आर लुकिंग फॉर यू नो फ्रूटिव ग्रेन और इफ यू आर लुकिंग फॉर वेल्थ इफ यू आर लुकिंग फॉर चिल्ड्रन इफ यू लुकिंग फॉर प्रमोशन यू कैन स्टिल टेक टू द चैंटिंग बिकॉज इट इज ऑल आर स्पीशियस chaitanya ras vigra purna shuddho and it just completely purifies us it's not not like the advertisement we see on the tv like 99.99% no it's 100% purna shuddho pu- completely purifies us nitya mukto and it completely elaborates you know us so again mukta from the sangha so again mukta sangha means from this material world it completely delivers us from this material bondage you know thinking that i am this body this particular mindset is completely removed we situate ourselves in a true constitution position as swarupa jivera swarupa ek shreya nitya das a true constitution position is a true dharma is as an eternal servant of lord shri krishna engaged in devotion service abhinatvam naam namino lord krishna's name and lord krishna they are not different abhinna hai ek dusre se so they are one and the same so karuna sindhu prabhu please engage in devotional service and we are chanting please do it in a mindful state with love with devotion with attention attraction affection and absorption and automatically it will improve and you will be able to rise above the nama prad stage to nama bhas stage and uh, namachary shila uh, 
Haridas Thakur, he reveals that even at Namabha stage, one can attain perfection. One can go back home, back to God, and one can get Krishna Prem. What to talk about? Shuddha Nam. If you can, we can all attain Shuddha Nam stage, of course, that is where the Bhakti Lata Beach will grow and rest at the lotus feet of Shri Shri Radha Krishna and bear fruits and will automatically in translative bliss, even if we are in this body. Hare Krishna. Hopefully, this answers your question. Hare Krishna. Prabhuji, there is just one more quick question by Basakhi Mataji. Hare Krishna. Um, <clears throat> she asked a question earlier. So, is Narad the prime disciple of every sampradaya? Hare Krishna. Uh, Devishi Narad is in Brahma sampradaya, right? So, he receives, you know, initiation from Lord Brahma. And Lord Brahma, through the heart, you know, is receiving the instructions from Lord Krishna in the form of the super soul. So again, Shirodakshai Vishnu. So again, there are four sampradayas, Brahma Sampradaya, Rudra Sampradaya, Kumar Sampradaya, and Shri Sampradaya. So Goddess Lakshmi is directly serving Lord Vishnu, so she gets instructions right from there. And there is a whole Shri Sampradaya, which is very much prevalent in the south, southern part of India, is coming from Goddess of Fortune. And then we have uh, you know Rudra Sampradaya which is coming from Lord Shiva and Lord Shiva is always meditating on Sankarshan and the cause of Sankarshan is Lord Balaam Adi Guru and then you know he is the supreme personality of Servitor Godhead so again if you look at it from the four Sampradayas it is you know you could they're all coming from Lord Krishna but his first expansion is you know uh, is Lord Balaam and then Devotional service is also said to be Krishna Akarshani. So again, Madan Mohan Mohini, that's another name, which is named for Radharani. So again, the origin of all four Sampradayas, if you try to trace it, goes back to Lord Krishna. And Radharani is his Karuna Shakti, as you know, Karuna Mai. So she, along with Adi Guru, you know, uh, Lord Balaam, they become the source. And then in our material universe, we see four Sampradayas. And then the fourth one is Kumar Sampradaya, Sanak Sanatan, Sanandana and Sanat Kumar. And it was Sanat Kumar whose disciple was Maharaj Prithu. So Prithu Maharaj actually received instructions, the instructing spiritual master for Maharaj Prithu was uh, Sanat Kumar. Now sometimes people could say, wait a minute, uh, what about his Diksha Guru? Well, in reality, if you look at even in Brahma Sampradaya, you know, we have personalities who were the Sampradaya doesn't have to be connected with initiating a spiritual master. Many of the personalities are associated in, and competing in Sampradaya through the instructing a spiritual master. Just like Gaurkishwadar Babaji had different initiating a spiritual master. But Bhakti Vinod Thakur was his instructing a spiritual master. So that's why he is in the Sampradaya. Devashi Narad gave instructions to uh, Vyasdev, Srila Vyasdev. Srila Vyasdev already had an initiating spiritual master that was Parashar Muni, his father, right? But Devashi Narad, so when we talk about Srila Vyasdev, it is very clearly given that, you know, he received instructions from Devashi Narad and so this Sampradaya is also being identified very clearly. And in Bhagavad Gita, Srila Prabhupada, he talks about uh, in the end of introduction of the different Sampradayas, right? So if you open the last page of the introduction of Bhagavad Gita as it is, then you will see that it is from Lord Krishna comes Lord Brahma. From Brahma comes Narad. Na from Narad comes Vyasdev. And from Vyasdev comes Madhva. And then from Madhva comes Padmanabh. And then Narhari is the seventh. And then Madhva. Hare then Akshobhya and so forth. So this hopefully answers your question. Yet at the same time, Lord... He empowers some living entities with some of his potency. So Devashi Narad is empowered with the devotion service. So that's the potency. Hare Krishna. Hopefully this answers the question. Hare Krishna Prabhuji. Is or questions nahin hai? So. Hare Krishna. Please give us the permission. Gantra Srimad Bhagavatam ki jai. Srila Prabhupada ki jai, Srila Bhagavad Pad ki jai, Nant Koti Vaishnam Vind ki jai, Nitai Go Premanande, Hari Hari Bol, Hare Krishna, Om Tat Sat.